So in 2014, in this very city, there was published in, in, mm-hmm. in the uh, front page of the New York Times on March 17th, St. Patrick's Day, was published an article that said, Space Ripples Herald the Origin of the Universe. And it was an announcement that the BICEP2 experiment had detected what are called gravitational waves, waves yeah. primordial waves of the ripples of space time. So BICEP... Uh, that's an acronym. What's an that acronym. acronym for? I created the acronym. It was a background imager of cosmic extragalactic polarization. I'm just checking his bicep. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You want something? You want yeah, something? exactly. <laughs> oh, no, I don't discriminate. Yeah, the yeah, bicep, equal, so equal, equal, what's, what's it looking thing? at? Space guns. <laughs> guns. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> give me back the acronym. <laughs> the space gun show. Background, by the bicep. background. imager mm-hmm. of cosmic extragalactic polarization. Now, oh. why is that so clever? Why is that not just a dad joke? Well, the signal that we're looking for is called polarization. And that polarization pattern, if you were to be able to see it with special polarized glasses, we'll get to in a few seconds, you would see a swirling, twisting, or curling pattern. So I wanted to make bicep the muscle that does curl. And I got away with the dad joke even before I had kids. I see what you did there. See See what you did there. (laughs) Uh That's not bad. The curl is is only exercises one muscle. No other muscle. Curl is the bicep. (laughs) 